Good morning, Bobcats, and happy Friday. Thanks for joining me this morning. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is Friday, December the 8th, and a special airy day for today. Our weather today is going to be a little bit warmer with a high of 66, a low 45. In the lunchroom today, they will be serving chicken nuggets, fish sticks, turkey sausage, cheese grits, and waffles. We want to wish these Bobcats a very happy birthday. We have quite a few of them. And um, JJ in fifth grade, Mahika. And then Chloe in first grade. Mahika, I apologize. I didn't write down what grade you are in. But happy birthday to all of you today. Happy birthday on Saturday to Anya in second grade. Hudson in kindergarten. Anaya in fourth grade. Wyatt in fourth grade. Cole in fourth grade. And Sawyer in fourth grade. On Sunday, Riley in second grade. Alina in first grade. And Nunu in second grade will be celebrating their birthdays. We, if you see any or all of these Bobcats, make sure and wish them a happy birthday. I'm going to sign off and we're going to go right into Terrific Kids. Remember to purr, be prepared, be upstanding, be responsible, and always be respectful. And in case we don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Good morning, Bobcats. I am back with another great group of terrific kids, and we're going to get started with Shrina from Miss Ishley's room. And this says, Shrina is a wonderful friend to her classmates. She demonstrates long, strong listening skills and is a great example for others. Great job. Keep it up. Next up from Mrs. Kerner's room, we have Judah Ledford, and this says Judah is our next terrific kid. He is working hard and is making good progress. Judah's smile and laugh lights up our room. Way to go, Judah. From Mrs. Lazarus's class, we have Addison Wilson. This says Addison is kind and helpful toward her teacher and classmates. Addison has a big personality that is funny, playful, and sweet. Way to go, Addison. We love having you in our class. Good job. From Mrs. McLeod's room, we have Lena Pruitt, and this says Lena is a super student. She is organized and a true classroom helper. Good job. From Mrs. McDermott's room, we have Cal Quinn, and this says Cal is trying his best to follow the rules. He is working hard in all subject areas, and it says I'm so proud of you, Cal. Good job. From Mrs. Oshlager's room, we have Peyton Jernigan. This says Peyton is our terrific kid this week because she is kind and friendly toward everyone. She listens and follows directions well, too. Good job, Peyton. All right, next up from Ms. Soper's room, we have Liam Reed. And this says Liam is a very kind soul. He is a deep thinker and loves to ask questions. Liam is kind to his classmates, and he makes sure that everyone is included in work and play. And he is a pleasure to have in class. Good job. From Mrs. Furman's room, we have Gabriel, and this says Gabriel is our terrific kid this week. Gabriel is a very kind friend to others and always follows classroom and school rules. Keep up the great work. Good job. From Ms. Register's room, we have Anson Gay, and this says Anson quietly goes about his day making certain he always does his best work. He is also terrific at sports and is a real team player. We are proud of him. Good job. From Mrs. Stark's room, we have Chrissy, and this says Chrissy is our terrific kid this week. Chrissy is a joy to have in the classroom. She is sweet and kind, and she's a good friend to her classmates, and it says we are so happy she's in our class this year. Good job. From Mrs. Schmidt's room, we have Wyatt Scott, and this says Wyatt was voted as our next terrific kid because he's kind to all of his classmates. He works hard, especially during math, and he is always helpful to his friends who need computer help. Way to go, Wyatt. From Mrs. Schrader's room, we have Walker McMullen, and this says Walker was voted by his classmates to be terrific kid this week because of his leadership, his teamwork, and his kindness towards others. Way to go, Walker. From Ms. Ganaway's room, we have Wyatt Wilder, and this says Wyatt is a terrific kid that displays kindness and respect every day toward his peers and teachers. He can always put a smile on your face, and we are thankful to have him in our class family. Good job, Wyatt. 
All righty, and from fifth grade, from Mrs. Doherty's room, we have Jordan Langley. This says, Jordan is so sweet. She is always smiling, willing to work with any classmate, and helps me whenever I need it. Keep working hard, staying kind, and keep moving forward. Good job, Jordan. All right, those are all of our terrific kids for this week. Stay tuned. You'll see all of their faces, and I'll catch you back next week with more terrific kids. Bye.